Okay, good afternoon, everyone. Before we get started, can I just ask if you have got your cell phone with you, could you just put that on silent for me, please? Oh, that was very quick. All right, could everyone please stand as the official party enters and remain standing? We will now have the national anthem, God Defend New Zealand. There will, however, be no singing aloud due to COVID restrictions, but the YouTube, ch YouTube clip you see features New Zealand sign language. Please feel free to join in with that. Thank you. Please be seated. I would like to welcome everyone here today to our Senior Academic Awards Ceremony for 2021 and to acknowledge those of you who are watching via live stream. My name is Sarah Hooper, Deputy Principal, and I'll be presenting today's awards ceremony. We will be celebrating the academic success of our students from last year. Our students have shown this through hard work, dedication, and application to their studies across many different disciplines in order to receive the awards being given out today. We're exceptionally proud of them and happily acknowledge their successes. I'd now like to ask our principal, Jane Stanley, to address you. Tēnā koutou katoa, te manu e te ka inga te miro no nā tēnā here. Te manu e ka ana te mataranga no nā te ao. No mai haere mai. Welcome and we are just absolutely delighted that we can be here to celebrate your success this afternoon. And it's very fitting that despite being a really small group, this is actually our first formal prize giving that we've held in our event centre since it was completed in the middle of last year. And for those of you who are already on your steps to leaving us, it's very fitting that you should be here because you've waited so long for this um, event centre. And I know that eventually we will get to fill it and, and use it, but it's just lovely that we can share that with you today. Um, despite needing to be a smaller group, it's a very special occasion where we are here to celebrate our top academic students 
and your exceptional successes. And that's not just the students that are able to be here in person, it's also those who have already started their journey towards um, tertiary education and other things, but are viewing on the live stream. So we're very pleased to have you engaged as well. We will be acknowledging our 2021 um, Year 11 and Year 12 top scholars at another time so that we can do that properly too. So first of all, congratulations on your huge successes last year. Overall as a school, we achieved excellent academic results and that is due to your diligence and your perseverance with your learning. And I'd also like to acknowledge the hard work that your teachers and the part that they played in your success in supporting you, helping you to achieve your goals. And even though there aren't very many here at the moment, I would like you to put your hands together, please, and to show your appreciation of them and the work they do. You have a very bright future with many choices ahead of you, and your commitment and resilience is an inspiration to others. And there will be other special people in your lives who have supported, encouraged, and inspired you to reach the stage of your journey that you're at. And I also encourage you to reflect and thank them for the part that they have played in your success. And I know that your parents and your wider whānau will be at the top of that list, and I'm sure that they are very proud of you too. The translation for the Whakatoki that I began with is the bird that feasts on the mirror berry Theirs is the forest. The bird that feasts on knowledge, theirs is the world. And the world is certainly yours. Go out there with confidence and don't underestimate the potential you have to make a positive difference, whether that is through your skills and expertise that you gain in a particular area that you wish to pursue, whether it's as a volunteer for a cause that you're passionate about, or whether it is just through inspiring others that you connect with as you go just by being you. You are a very inspiring group of young people. To those of you who are leaving us or have really left us and are on your way for next steps, please come back and share your stories with the other students, the next generation of students here at Westlake Girls because you can add a lot of value to them. So congratulations again and very best wishes for your future and for those students in year 12 who will be with us, we certainly wish you a really successful year as well. Thank you. Thank you, Mrs Stanley. So the first lot of awards will be our Cups and Awards and these are normally handed out at our senior prize giving at the end of the year in front of the recipients, peers and family. We were unable to do this last year so it's our pleasure to be able to present some of these awards today instead. We thank many of the Year 13 cohort from 2021 for joining us in person today. It's really nice to see you back. Just some instructions on how you're going to receive your awards today. It's a little bit different than normal. We're going to ask that prize winners come to the front of the stage and collect your award, as well as a bunch of flowers at the end um, when your name is called. Each student will be called individually, and since we have a small group, we won't be calling in groups. You can clap after each name. Once you pick up your award, can I ask that you please head to the photo wall at the back and have your official photograph taken with your award, and after this, please return to your allocated seat. We kindly ask that all cups and trophies, as much as they are lovely, um, are returned to us at the end of the ceremony, so make sure you get plenty of photos with them. The names of those not present will be read out today, um, because many are watching via live stream, and we'd like to acknowledge their successes. So the first group of awards are for subject, cups and trophies. Sydney, Sydney Brandolino, Creative Writing Cup. <laughs> Sophie Digraft, University of Auckland Faculty of Arts Year 12 Award for Achievement in Humanities and Social Studies. <laughs> We've got a bit of a gap, some of these people aren't able to be here. So Lucy Jobbins, Excellence in Languages Cup. Victoria Barber, Art Design, Design Scholarship. Sarah Binney, Year 13 Practical Geography Cup, Excellence in Spanish, Geography Scholarship, and Excellence in, uh, sorry, in Geography Scholarship. Cara Clark Howard, Excellence in Technology. Ariana George, Excellence in Te Reo Māori. Jamie Hanrahan, the award for Hard Materials Technology. Natalia Hayes, 
the Senior Social Studies Global Citizenship Award. Yvonne Liu is getting the award for Excellence in Senior Statistics, Biology Scholarship, Geography Scholarship, and Statistics Scholarship. Grace Park, Excellence in Japanese, and Alyssa Rattray, Excellence in Physical Education, Top All-Rounder. Elisa Shen gets the Art Photography Prize and Photo Life Photo Award. <laughs> Janine Tiakia, Musician of the Year. Danny Tsankov, Contribution to Senior Performing Arts Music, Academic Excellence in Social Sciences, Classical Studies Scholarship, and History Scholarship. <laughs> Jin Um, Excellence in Mathematics. Lily Winchester, Excellence in Science Award, Biology Scholarship, and Chemistry Scholarship. Naomi Yakshin, Senior French Speaking Cup. Judy Zhang, Excellence in English and English Scholarship. <laughs> Our next set of awards are for those who did receive scholarship. So scholarship is the top academic examination for high school students in New Zealand. A scholarship is awarded to the top 3% of students in the country in each subject and outstanding scholarships are obtained by the top 1% of those. In 2021, NCA examinations, Westlake Girls was awarded 66 scholarship to our students with four of them at outstanding level. This is a wonderful feat of academic excellence. We have a number of those students here today and we would like to acknowledge their success. They'll be read out in groups of year 12 students from 2021 and then year 13. So Sybil Carver, History Scholarship. Leah DeLuca, French Scholarship. Isabel Glover, English Scholarship. Kaylee Howe, Technology Scholarship. <laughs> Ayane Kondo, Japanese Scholarship. Rayanne Liao, Biology Scholarship. <laughs> Lauren McPhee, Biology Scholarship and Geography Scholarship. Ivy Mitchell, Media Studies Scholarship. Kate Mull, History Scholarship. Joan O, oh, Biology Scholarship. Trisha Tan, Design and Visual Communication Scholarship. Ella Wilson, Geography Scholarship. <laughs> Jessica Zeng, Biology Scholarship. <laughs> and Emily Zhu, Classical Studies Scholarship, Geography Scholarship, and History Scholarship. <laughs> Our Year 13 Scholarship winners who are here today. Maria Avendo, Avenido, sorry, apologies, English Scholarship. <laughs> Anita Du, Geography Scholarship and Media Studies Scholarship. <laughs> Anya Johns, Biology Scholarship. Binu Kularanthi, Rathney, sorry, Biology Scholarship. Gloria Lai, Biology Scholarship and Health and Physical Education Scholarship. <laughs> Na Young Lee, Design Scholarship. Kathy Lee, Biology Scholarship. <laughs> Chelsea Leong, Technology Scholarship. Alice Ma, English Scholarship. Caitlin McConchie, 
History Scholarship and Media Studies Scholarship. Shita Mo, Biology Scholarship and Chinese Scholarship. <laughs> Izzy Newton Cross, Drama Scholarship. Lily Chi, Biology Scholarship, English Scholarship, History Scholarship and Statistics Scholarship. <laughs> Yvonne Ting, Biology Scholarship. Jasmine Tsai, Biology Scholarship. Tessa Watson, Classical Studies Scholarship. <laughs> Zoe Wu, Biology Scholarship, English Scholarship and Statistics Scholarship. Zoe Ziting Wu, English Scholarship. <laughs> Seda Zaidi, Biology Scholarship and English Scholarship. I would now like to introduce our short musical item, Chopin Sonata Movement One, played by Audrey Guo.
Thank you, Audrey, for that beautiful piece. Amazing. Played on our lovely New Steinway. Um, our last set of awards are our Special and Supreme Awards. Um, they ought to be read with citations. So I ask um, Lorraine, uh, Lorraine Coote from the International Department, Director of International, to come and uh, read the citation for the International Student of the Year. It gives me great pleasure to share with you this afternoon about our International Student Award winner, Francine Wijija. While not here in person today, Francine has left behind a strong legacy at Westlake through her outstanding academic achievements and her desire to make the most of every opportunity that came her way during her time here in New Zealand. Francine joined us in year 12 from Indonesia in January 2020 and left in December of last year. She was a conscientious and self-motivated student who always displayed a, a mature approach to her studies. This was very evident in her NCEA results. She gained excellence in all five of her level three subjects. Her excellent work ethic, along with her desire to do well, will stand her in good stead for tertiary study. Francine really impressed the international team and her teachers last year not only with her outstanding academic results, but also her contribution to the rich cultural tapestry of Westlake. Francine was very goal-focused with the aim of being accepted into a Canadian university. This she achieved. She spent a lot of time researching the various courses available and the employment opportunities these courses could lead to. We are very proud of this extremely hardworking, confident and talented young woman and we wish her all the very best for her studies at the Lagara College in Vancouver this year. And now I'd like to invite Grace Chen to come forward. Over there. Um, and Mrs Stanley will read her citation. And Grace is receiving the Senior Speech Cup, her award for gaining scholarship in English last year, as well as the Head Prefect Cup. And it's a real privilege for me to be able to read this citation for you, Grace. When Grace took up the position of Head Prefect in 2001, we already knew that she had outstanding leadership qualities and that she would be a strong and respected role model for our students. We'd watched her grow from year nine and gain confidence and competence as she involved herself in a wide range of school activities. Westlake Concert Band, Symphony Orchestra, Amnesty, Cultural and Service Committees, Premier Advanced Debating Team, um, Librarian, and Smart Swans Tutor. And Grace was passionately committed to every endeavor tackling challenges with a calm maturity beyond her years. It was as our student trustee on the board that Grace's dedication to our school and students became acutely evident. The dignity she brought to the discussion table belied her sometimes relentless commitment to advocating on behalf of her students. As a debater, Grace knew how to present an idea and she wasn't afraid to defend it. Academically, Grace has also achieved impressive results from being our top achieving NCA level one student to scholarship in English last year. One of the things that stands out for me about Grace's time as a head prefect was her ability to inspire and capture people's attention through her speech writing and presenting, choosing topics that students could relate to and always personalizing them with fun stories from her own life and experiences. Grace's speeches were uplifting and inspirational. I remembered her speech at um, last year's full school assembly where she uh, shared the mantra, maybe so, maybe not, and as a way of tackling feelings of being overwhelmed. She described our school as a totara tree, teachers being the fibrous roots, and who, knowledge, who nourish, I should say, the shoot systems with knowledge, and students being the branches and leaves. Sometimes students are the leaves that bloom and glow in the sunshine, and sometimes they show loyalty by becoming the branches that support these leaves. 
Grace, during your time at Westlake, you were both the shining example for others and the loyal support behind the scenes. We hope that your roots are deeply embedded here at Westlake and we thank you for, our, for your service to our school. We wish you all the very best for your exciting plans for 2022 and beyond and we look forward to welcoming you, you back here in the future. Thank you. I would now like to invite Rosalie Dell to come forward. Rosalie's citation will read by Mrs Hamling. It gives me great pleasure to read the citation, Rosalie. The Phillips Cup is presented for academic excellence, sporting success, and leadership, and is awarded to Rosalie Dill. Rosalie is an exemplary student. She has consistently achieved academic and personal success, gaining NCA Level 1, Level 2, and Level 3 endorsed with excellence. She has undoubtedly gained this award due to her determination and hard work while supporting her peers as a Waira House Academic Prefect and a valued team member of the Senior Premier Basketball Team. Rosalie is kind and caring and completes all tasks with pride. She has gained respect amongst her peers and teachers with her diligence and willingness to lend a hand, demonstrating true leadership. It is no surprise that Rosalie is receiving this award today. Well done, Rosalie. Ask Hannah Jones to come forward, please. And her citation will be read by Mrs. Wilson. Hannah Jones has been an active and positive member of the music department for her full five years at Westlake. She's been a member of several choirs, including the Premier Choir's Cantare and Correlation, and was appointed as choir leader for Cantare in her final year. Hannah also played saxophone in the Premier Westlake Concert Band and Westlake Big Band, as well as playing percussion in the Premier Westlake Symphony Orchestra. In fact, during year 12, Hannah was a member of all five Premier Music Groups, which is a massive time commitment to manage alongside all of her other interests in academic studies. Hannah consistently displayed a positive attitude and growth mindset throughout her musical development and endeavours. She has been an excellent role model to her peers and is well respected by her music teachers and directors. I personally want to thank Hannah for her five years of service to our special department. Another aspect of Hannah is her altruistic nature, with Hannah being very focused on giving back to the wider community. She was a very dedicated service prefect for Hauriki House and worked well with her committee organising bake sales and a market day to raise funds for blind, low vision New Zealand guide dogs. She was also instrumental in organising and coordinating volunteers for the Well Foundation which saw Westlake girls supporting the experience of patients at North Shore Hospital at the weekends. Overall, Hannah is a very worthy recipient of the Jeffreys Cup. Congratulations. I would ask Sarah Penny to come forward now, but I believe she's already done at Wellington, ready to start university. Uh, but her citation will be read by Mrs Bickerstaff this afternoon. It is my pleasure to read the citation for Sarah Penny, who has received the Elise Bradley Cup. Sarah has been an active and integral part of the school community over her time at Westlake, excelling in a number of areas, both academic and cultural. As a theatre sports leader, a prefect and board, board of trustees rep, Sarah generated trusted relationships with both students and adults alike, and has been an upstanding representative for the school. Her extracurricular interests in performing arts have seen Sarah perform in a number of Westlake productions and achieve scholarship drama in consecutive years as both a Year 12 and a Year 13 student. This is in addition to her scholarship achievements in English and Media Studies. Sarah's maturity and enthusiasm have contributed to her success and remind us that it is not what we do, but how we do it that matters. Congratulations, Sarah.
And finally, it's my pleasure to announce the last two awards of the afternoon. Can I have Baha Khalil Nijad come forward, please? Baha is a hardworking student who has maintained an outstanding academic record during her time at Westlake Girls High School. She's achieved level in, uh, NCA Level 1, 2 and 3 with an academic excellence endorsement and has attained a total of 264 excellence credits. Baha also gained scholarships in chemistry and physics in 2021 and got every single one of her credits at Level 3 at excellence level. Baha's teachers describe her as a conscientious and motivated student who demonstrates a keen interest in a wide range of subjects. She has a strong work ethic, tenacity, and a love for all things science and consistent, excellent student. Baha is a well-loved, respected role model and a valued member of our school community. She embodies this not only for her work ethic and academic excellence, but with her incredible attitude and conscientious spirit. Today, Baha is receiving awards for Excellence in Graphics, Excellence in Physical Sciences, Chemistry Scholarship, Physics Scholarship, and the Prowse Cup, Proxima Akesit to the Ducks. Congratulations. She might need some help carrying all those awards. All right, and Maggie Zoe, I would like you to come forward, please. Maggie is a devoted student to all aspects of school life. She has been involved in many clubs and committees, as well as being a talented musician. She shares her knowledge with her peers through the Smart Swans program and has been an integral part of the Wairau House Service and Cultural Committee. Her profound time management skills have allowed her to be involved in all of these many opportunities while also being endorsed with excellence across all NCA levels and maintaining a top academic record. Last year, Maggie passed all her NCA standards with excellence and was awarded scholarships in economics, geography, statistics, and outstanding scholarship in accounting. She was also recognized for her success in business studies and is awarded the Commercial Studies Cup. I'd like to congratulate Maggie as our Westlake Girls High School Ducks for 2021. I know that it's not the same as receiving these awards in person in front of your peers, but we do really appreciate you being here, and hopefully many of your family members and friends are watching on the live stream. That does conclude our awards ceremony for today. We'd like to again acknowledge the success of all our students, both here in person and those watching via the live stream. A huge congratulations from us. Please stand while the official party leaves the stage to the Westlake School song played by Fiona Wilson. Thank you. And once again, congratulations to all of you. Um, if you'd like to have a photo with your trophy um, or award, please do so um, on your own, own devices, um, and then you can place them at the front here. Thank you so much for coming today. Have a great afternoon.